the bullet actually went through and through, so, and it didn't hit any major organs or anything. Um, and I'm gonna be okay, I'm in a lot of pain, but, um, I'm able to walk, which is amazing, and the doctors say it's a miracle. Thank goodness, for the first time we are hearing from the 19-year-old who was kidnapped and shot by her abductor. As you saw, Alina Adnoralov took to Instagram and her blog. Now, she did it to explain how a man got into the passenger seat of her car in East Nashville, then forced her to go to an ATM at gunpoint. She says she drove through rush hour traffic with a gun pointed right at her. When they got to the ATM in West End, she says a voice told her to park at the ATM so that she would need to open the door to reach it. She pulled the lever and ran, but the gunman shot her. She told uh, News 4's, uh, she told News 4 that uh, she's now home and she's recovering. She thought he just let go, but then they showed her the sweater that she was wearing, where he was holding her, and it was just torn up. So he was holding on so hard, and she ran and fought so hard that it actually ripped the sweater. Wow, this is a picture of the shooter right here, released by police shortly after this happened. He is still on the loose tonight. If you're watching this, the person who did this, um, you, you're only making it easier on yourself by turning yourself in because, you know, it's only a matter of time so, until they, they catch you. Now, Alina is a songwriter and thanks everyone in the community for reaching out and donating to her GoFundMe account, which we have a link to on WSMV.com.